Okay, in uh, my last video, I showed you how to add all of these div tags, your wrapper, and then your four main div tags, or how many, however many you need, as well as a tracing image. Okay, well now you're going to notice that if you go and preview this in browser, um, it's going to show up like this. Basically, here's your banner. You can put your banner there navbar main content side content well we don't want it to look like that we want it to look like this so first off what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to make another div tag inside our banner that's going to really fit in to this and be like the same size as this so basically what i mean by that is we need to find out how much room there is going to be around here how much room is going to be around here so just pull out some guidelines and it'll help you out. Okay. So, 150 pixels by 550 by uh, 900, I believe. We'll just get rid of that one. Yeah, 150 by 900. So, we'll just write banner uh main banner we'll write main banner just copy that add a new div tag paste that for the id and there we have a banner inside our banner so what we're going to do is we're going to click on that and do a new css rule click less specific once so that it's in your banner and click ok ok so now we have to go to box size and the width we want it to be 900 by how high was it 150 I think maybe yeah I'm pretty sure it was 150 and next what we want to do is we want to add padding so we're going to check off same for all and we're going to do 30 pixels was on the top on the right was how many um, 30 I believe the left was 30 and I think 0 on the bottom alright so there we go we have our area in here, which we can now just add our image to. And there we have it. We'll preview this in the browser. And there, it fits perfectly, which is what we want. Okay, so now we'll do this with these ones. Um, navbar. I'll just call it main navbar. Okay, and actually I forgot to uh, check the sizes of this, so it's going to be uh, I believe that's supposed to be 290 that it starts at, maybe, yeah. Yeah, it starts at 290. Okay, so new CSS rule. Oops, select that one. Wait. Navbar is what we wanted. Okay. So let's do that again. Uh, the width was 900 by 55 pixels. Okay. Oh, and it looks like I forgot something which was the margin same for all top is 15 pixels 30 pixels and 30 pixels okay so now what we can do is we can click on this and uh, we can add our background which is going to be our navigation bar so to do that we want to click on it go to oops click on it and uh yeah because we're using CSS we're going to click on that and background we're going to select our background image yeah for a second there I thought we were using uh, just a sliced image but yeah we're using CSS so we're going to put that in there and there's our background which now we can type text over home about and all that stuff but I'm going to show you how to do 
your uh, navigation bar in the next video. So I'm just going to finish up these last few uh, div tags. So main content area. Okay, and we want this how wide? 580. Okay, so 550 by 1250. Alright, so I'll click on that. New CSS rule. Less specific. And uh, 550 by 1250. Oops, and yeah, I forgot again the padding. So the side on the left, we had 30 pixels. Do we have any more? No, just 30 pixels on the side. There we go. Yeah, I always forget the padding. I don't know, I just do. Side content area. You can name this whatever you want. I'm just bad at making names. Okay. And we'll be less specific again. Box. We wanted that. What? That's 900 to uh, 580. That's what? 900 minus 580. 320. I think it's going to be 1250. And we'll do 30 pixels to the right. Oops, actually, we didn't need that because I didn't do the full size. So I'll fix the width to how wide should it be at 30 pixels? 50. There we go. Okay, so there we go. We added all of our other div tags. And now what we can do, well actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to fix this one. And um, add some padding to the top because there was actually supposed to be a gap between there of about 15 pixels. So 15. And, uh, 15. Okay, so there, we're finally done adding all of our div tags, and now we can start to uh, finish off our website and just add images and our finish off our navigation bar, which I'm going to show you in the next video, so check that out.